luck, everyone. All right, uh, here we are at the Pocono 400. This is the 80 laps around, uh, around Pocono. It's, uh, I'm starting on the pole out of 31 cars. I'm car number five. I had a pretty decent qualifying lap of uh, 54, uh, 0 75. Um, I do know there's uh, some guys that are behind me that didn't qualify that are faster than me. I am uh, hope to take it easy. I'm a little nervous being on the pole. Um, but uh, I'm going to try to run my race and uh, not worry about uh, where other people are. Um, it's very easy to spin out here on all three corners. Very, very easy. Uh, it's kind of hard to put a bunch of laps. So I'll probably uh, start out in third gear because it's easy to spin your tires here too. So uh, I expect there to be a lot of uh, pace laps. Hopefully there's some entertaining uh, conversations going on. But uh, oh, it should be an interesting race. I should have too. If we don't grid, it's the same as starting from the pits? Yeah. yeah. Ah, crap. Yeah, I really should. I, I am thinking, like, damn, that was stupid of me. Well, it looks like about a third of the field is starting in the pits. Yeah, that's fine. Then that means a third of the field is smart. <laughs> William, I'm taking it easy at the start, so just be patient on it. It'd be cool if everybody started in the pit, see what happens. All right, man. It's good. I'm going to be taking it easy, too, Timothy. Yeah, me too. Might be short shifting. Tempted to start in third. He's into the gas, you can start in second just fine. I'm starting at third too, no worries. Famous last words, he's into the gas. Alright, here we go. Green, green, green. Both things are rolling up there. Guys, I back off my corners a lot, so don't get mad. Diego, was that necessary? You had to come up there and bump me. He was, he was on the inside. What happened? I know, you just wanted to get a 4X in early. All right, one lap led. Around. 
you're doing a hell of a job between keeping it out of the fence. Keep well, I'm happy. I made three laps. That's pretty good. Pit road will still be closed. Proud of you guys. All of you. Good job. I'm not happy Get because there behind the start, start. Somebody comes up, taps you in the rear end, gives you four back for whatever reason. How's your car, William? That sucked. I, I don't know. I'm sure I got a little damage back there. Well, I'd be lucky to pit, fix it now. And All right. Uh, the reason why I qualified was because uh, I knew that there was going to be a lot of spin-outs, a lot of crashes, and I was worried about being behind them and trying to have it avoid uh, spin-outs and crashes. Um, no, I still might have to do it, but uh, I'd rather do it with less cars in front of me. And so I'm hoping to stay out near the front uh, the whole race. Um, that's that's what I'm hoping for. Uh, you never know what's actually going to happen, but but that's what I'm hoping for. All right. Hopefully there's some good uh, chat. Or not necessarily. Not if I race and pick it. Sometimes it's hard to type when you're trying to drive, honestly. Open TV this next time I don't do it. Just so you know. Careful. Careful. Yeah, I, there's no way I'm going to try and type and drive. It's the auto chat. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah, the 12 is a perfect example of that. They don't have a mic or keyboard. They can't tell you nothing. Nah, my auto chat only says you're an asshole and jerk off and things like that. I don't have anything nice like that. can't run your computer without a keyboard. If I race and takes the chat away, you can. I know, you can do everything but chat. I know Vladimir behind me is uh, much faster than I am. nice if you didn't run through all the pit stalls, please. He runs uh, about a uh, second faster than I do. 30 seconds of damage, 36, something like Don't forget, a lot of Europeans don't use uh, race chat. I was on a muting spree last night. There was just so many people talking that were annoying me. It was mostly kids, though. I mean, when the kids start talking, the mature ones I'm cool with, but, you know, the 10-year-olds that just act stupid, they got to go. Uh, are you talking about Christopher? Well, I'm not going to name any names. They got that irritating high-pitched voice. I don't care what they sound like, it's what they say. As long as they're talking about something for the race. That, that's, that's, I, I kind of agree with you. I mean, as long as it's, it's race chat, that's cool. But when we're going to the green, there's no reason for anyone to be talking unless it's to do with what's happening on the track. And they don't stop. I've been on a race with a guy that gave us play by play at every move he was doing. William, check his car and see if it's flashing. I wonder if Ping might have had something to do with it. Hey, Travin, is that a skills car from some race team or is that. I went in to see it. Uh, it could. What was that, Josh? A26, go by me. Is that car a race car that's actually used on circuit? Is that a paint scheme that's on the, the on the circuit, or is that something you just made up? It's a Kyle Busch scheme. Oh, okay, I knew it looked familiar. My first idea when you said cowboy scheme was the rodeo stuff. <laughs> I figure you're talking football. Go past, guys. Go past. Go past the 30 car. It's 
Last night with the open setup, I felt so secure in the car. With this setup, it's just it breaks so quick that I'm too busy racing the track to race you guys. Go past. Just tell me to stay behind you. I hope we can hook up again, uh, Tim, after the start. Yeah, we were doing good for before. Go ahead and go past 20. It's telling me to stay behind you. Now, so I can go by you. The one to go at the line. Make sure you check about everything one last time. Will the inside row? Same here, Rod, and everybody behind me. I'm going to start in third gear, too, probably. All right, outside line from uh, fourth. I'm on the inside, so ease up, guys. Uh, guys behind me, I'm going to be starting along the inside wall because I don't want the same surprise William got. I was going to say I'm kind of worried about the row behind us. Okay, what's happening with the numbers? It's like 9, 11, 8, 13. It'll fix when it goes by the start finish. Did that a couple times last night. Yeah, everybody just crossed start finish in and out order. I uh, warned uh, Wolfgang that I was going to be starting in third gear, just like I warned. Uh, I, now, I got a question. I swear the scoreboard the back here worked at one time. Did they turn it off? They must have, because I'm right there with you. Maybe if you have your graphic settings down, like mine. I've got mine cranked all the way up, and it's not on. Yeah, same here. Okay, well, okay, let's enjoy this race. Good luck, guys. Be patient at the start, let it cycle out. Yeah, because I'm starting in third. All right, man. I will watch in front of you, and uh, I will go get him. Green, green, green. Rolling good, rolling good. No checking up, no checking up. Outside at your door, bumper. In the middle, there you go, bud. Clear high, clear high right there, two wide. Man. Come on, man, that's three wide. Clear, hit your mark, hit your mark, you're all clear. In the middle, three wide. Well, I saw this wide. happen. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. 24, must have got a plant right there. He spun into three. What was that about, 28? Tiago warped into the back of my car, got 4X. I saw him bounce like three times. He lunged into me. Yeah, I think he blew a left That's the same guy that got me. Yeah, I saw it coming. I tried to move out of the way, but I couldn't. Whether you're on three wide in turn one. Nope, but it give me about. 30 seconds, I can have it up. Go for it. When you're ready, just hit me up on it. Go past we were, 25. I didn't realize we were three wide there. Past I thought the guy two. was drifting up. Yeah, thanks for not coming out and hitting me, Five. Appreciate it, man. Get up there behind the three. I was just trying to hold my line at the bottom. I didn't want to slam on the brakes, you know. I checking up. And, checking up in front one, guys. Hey, Scott, that was actually very funny what you put up there. I just didn't want to say anything while we're coming to the green. Can one of you guys type, Tiago, you are warping bad? Because I can't see my keyboard at night. He might have voice off. Uh, Trevin, are you all right, man? I'll find out in a minute. Did you just back it in the wall, or? I got it to spin. I got the left side in the wall, maybe a little bit of the back. I got bad luck with Trevin. 
Yeah, it looked like you hit hard enough to do some damage for me. He was saying he couldn't tell it was three wide. I don't know how he can't tell. Slow down the it was tunnel, guys. Slow down the tunnel. I had 40 seconds of damage. It shouldn't be too bad. And Wolfgang on the inside of me. Uh, what the tunnel? The last the bridge? No, the, the, what is the last street? What is that called? I don't know that it has a name. Short shoot? Yeah, that's what I'm, that's what's coming to my head, short shoot. I think that's what it is. Yeah, that's what they always uh, call that, the short shoot. Here. Now we can stop a little short, because we're going to have somebody coming around. Okay, us. let's all call it the same thing. I'm just going to stay up. I don't think I'm damaged. Sorry, Todd, I'm just clutching it. I'm not trying to mess with hey, you. Hey, this is Lucky Doll, they just said. Yeah, that, that stuff don't bother me anyway. 37, 36 repairs. I'm just seeing how much fuel I can tell you. I'm doing the same thing, I'm clutching it too. Yeah, I just wanted the 18 to know that I wasn't trying to mess with him. So good. How many, uh, what is the fuel run here? Around 30 laps, I believe. Who was it that made it three wide then, Robert? I guess it was the 16 then? I have no clue. I was just watching him behind me, lunging forward, and then I was in the wall. I'm going to go take a look at it. I'm going to go pit again. I'll let you know. But there was another wreck in front of me. I mean, I wasn't into turn one yet. And I, it was already spinning in the middle of one, two. Yeah, I didn't mean to push it three wide. I didn't know you had a guy on the inside of you. Where's the tail end at? Well, the field's just going through one right now. So, uh... Kind of let Trevin know what, what happened there, that Wolfgang was on the inside, and he went on the outside of me. Made a three wide situation, and then we kind of touched. Well, the knife. He ended up getting the worst. I don't have to get behind me on this restart. So, uh, it's possible I might have damage. I'm not sure, but I'm not going to go fix anything. Um, whoever's going to, whoever's going to be in front of 28, watch out. His but, car lunges about 10, 20 feet at a time until it's into you. I might have to start in second gear so that doesn't happen to me again. I, I warned the guys too. I warned yeah, them. I if you keep tracing, you should be able to report him. I tried going inside to give him room, but he did the same thing. He went inside, so we just kept on going in a straight line. That was Wolf, Wolf and me. That put it three wide, but you came way up the track, Alan. Okay, Tiago, I saw that you weren't intentionally ramming people. 
Oh, it was me asking about a different three wide in a certain one scenario. Yeah, clutching it, I'm only using like a tenth of a gallon. So I would at least exit out he, once and come back in and see if it's better. He told me I took it's it not better than we can give you one to go this next time by outside road. Get up there behind the stick. And he's gone. I'm pretty sure I've raced him before and he's not a lunatic. No, he's usually a pretty good racer. Nah, yeah, he said he was leaving. He didn't want to cause any problems. Okay, now I'm just going to try to find a place where I can settle in. It's kind of hard with so many, so many pace laps to find a nice place where you can settle in, where you got a nice uh, second and front. Yeah, you could have. I don't know why I left. That's what I would have done. Just do SR laps. That's what I did, That's what I did last. And this track is so wide in most places, you know, you could be a little bit off pace and still not be a threat, except for this turn right here. And the pace laps are so long, you could almost exit out and get back in with only going, without, with only going one lap down. Starting in third. She came. Same here, starting right, in third. I'll call the green. Green, green, green. Rolling good now, rolling good, rolling good. No open. No open. 27, you have to pass me. Come on. Sorry, Brian, I missed the shift. All good. Can't have it on the outside. <laughs> Ricky, I was going to let you go, but I'm going to go. Side door. Door, buffer. Clear low, clear low, clear low. What was that? Wow, this got ugly. What the hell happened up here? Spinning out to, spinning out to. Inside, inside. Clear, 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 clear. Door. Clear. 
clear. One inside. Low car inside, look out. Thanks for the room there, Bob. All clear. Woo. Shit, sorry. I just must be in the wrong place at the wrong time here. There you go, man. Bye, get the help. Clear, clear, clear. Synchronized spinning. Did you hit the wall? Nope. All I did is run off a little bit. I saw him spin it. Damn, Ty, you got that thing hooked up on the bottom there. Yeah, he's still fought in the track. I heard a car hitting a wall back there. Down there at your door. Clear low. Go ahead, Ricky. You're faster than me for the rest of the course. Right, you good man. <laughs> we both do that. Break earlier for that turn, it's easier. Cross out, cross out, cross out, cross out. Holy crap. Straight guys, slow down long straight, that means turn one. A lot of foam Stop up on the there front. on the door. I hope to God your brakes were working nine. Yeah, right below the yellow line looks the best right here. Good run, top five. They're hanging a hard right once you get And me, I was there. Only me out, jeez. Oh, I didn't see you, man. Go <laughs> past that 31. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. Yeah, me and the 16 are right behind you guys. That's some damn good racing up there, though. I'm in survival mode, Ricky, so I'm not going to spike you. No, me too. It's my first time here, and I'm garbage. I've been here before, but not on this tire model. There's been a lot of changes since I've been here. Guys, you need to go and pace kind of right behind me. To be able to race this good right now, don't jinx myself, but, you know, I'm surprised, honestly. Check up in the middle of the second straight away there. Long time. Check up in the medium shoot. Well, I'm not talking about my speed. I'm just talking about I was spinning out like crazy in practice, but now I'm kind of calmed down and I got a feel for it. Line up behind the 14. Yeah, same here. I'm just really backing my corners off too. Okay, so what is this one? Is this turn two? 
Turn two is the tunnel. It's in front of the scoreboard. No, I don't have a lot of graphics. How many turns is on this track? Three. I, I actually think there's six, but legally there's three. Okay, so that was two back there, and we're now over three. Yes. Well, it looks like I, I'm done. I'm out, guys. Time. It is going to open this time. Too bad, Rod. 4,500, 4,500. And clear in and clear Yeah, out. well, the, the nine was junked. And he was trashed, and he was just rolling, you know, not under power anymore, just rolling across the middle of the track. Yeah, it's just going to happen. We got two Toyotas and a Chevy up here? Or two Chevys? No damage. Coming high, coming high. Get up there behind the 15. Actually, I don't want to race next to Travin, so I'm actually going to pit again. I know it seems stupid, but I don't think I'm going to do that. Play the back of the field game, I guess. I think they got a little too wild up here. I think I'm going to drive through just to get in the back. You all right, Robert? Yeah, it's just when my tires are cold, I'm. Eesh. Fighting it a lot out of four. I don't want to be that guy. Yeah, I got you, Robert. Uh, just honestly, back off the corner. That's there's those markers. If you back off a little bit more than you think you should, you'll be fine, man. Michael, you gotta come by me. I'm wanting the pit. Thank you. There's still 59 laps left. I don't mind being in the back. I can't believe we've had as many green laps as we have. I think you'll catch up with the pace that you got right there. All right, behind that 12, go past that 19. Oh, see what it's like back here. Line up behind the 22. I'm going to need to tear my windshield tear off soon because this is getting a little ugly. Behind that 22. Hey, Travin, do you want to look at my right side? Can you see anything at all? A little bit to the front right. Oh, yeah, temple. It doesn't look that bad, though. I'm sure my car looks a lot worse. Yeah, it was like uh, 
five and a half seconds of the damage. Behind that, 22. One to go at the line. Should clean them up real good before we got to double up. We'll be outside row. Line up behind the eight. Behind that eight. A lot of people bitten. I think I'm pretty much back where I was. I guess if they just want to go around yeah, you're pretty me, close. they can do that. I want to be in back because it's easier to start in third back there. We have time to build up some speed. Yeah, you time right. I passed the whole field before we got into one. I was in Daytona when Kyle Bush did that during the shootout. Passed the whole damn field from back. I'll be in Daytona for the next race. Nice. Good luck, guys. Right. Here we go again. Crank, crank, crank. Rolling good, man. Rolling good. They're pushing in front of you there. They're bumper to bumper. Door. You're clear, you're clear. Got a car going around, watch out guys. He's mowing the line. He's okay. Clear, clear, clear. I got some work to do. Ooh, that was rough. And I'm just following and let you screw up. Outside, outside. Right. Jeez. Clear, 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 clear. There you go. Going in the street, so. Nice save, Austin. Wow, that's close.
nice to be with a careful group. Door, bumper. All clear. About got the wall again there. Go on, Michael. Danny. Clear by one. You know I'm going to buy you again, Ricky. Yeah, I know. Crap, you learn turn two. Go on, Timothy.
I can't see on my damn windshield. Get quick. Door. Clear. Not open yet, Stevie, from what I can tell. Yeah, not open yet. Do not pit. Get up there behind the 15. Slow down on the front street, guys. Wow, you guys are that far. Race cars in turn one. Go past that 31. Well, Adamar, you might want to take off the train tracks you got on that car, because Jesus Christ, dude. Let me guess, the dude with the 53? Yeah, no, I, I think he did it. I, th I think he's doing it fair. I mean, I don't think he's doing anything because I got down to a 54-1, and I know I could have got more, so, and that was during this race, so, you know, I, I take my words back. You can get down in like 53 ones. I have no doubt he deserves it because I did 55 and I suck monkey balls. No, he's just hitting his marks. This setup's just like him. Managed to get back to third eight right? after my little mowing at it. Getting ready to take off a little bit here. Not like John behind me. I was tempted to stay out just to lead a lap. Me too. <laughs> Shit. Too far forward by like a foot. Do we get five points for leading? No. Uh oh. I just pulled a Dell Jr. on pit road. Damn it! We used to not got thousand three. Probably gonna be a couple laps here to clean the track. Go past that gate. Pass that three. Go past that gate. Do you feel only or something, Green? Pass that ten. Go past that three. Go past that three. Behind that thirty-one. He said he drove through his box. Oh. I just got word in a uh, lower split that Nim Cross just removed somebody indefinitely. Wait, what? Inappropriate language or bad driving? It didn't say. There was uh, several people in a race with him last night that protested him. But Nim come in, watched a few laps, and booted him. I think I know who this might be. I don't want to say the name because I know you're not supposed to. Does it start with an M? Does it end with an N? No. 
it's always nice to see uh, real results. Yeah, they didn't say what it was for, so I don't know if it was something last night or what was in there. Yeah, it can't be him. He come in and booted him. More than likely, they're going to remove his name from the results, too. So. Wow, look at that. You got 25 on lead lap, but the rest the are number basically one driver out. In that room. <laughs> Get up there behind the 31. Uh, I don't think you'll be now. If you, if you get caught cursing, they'll they'll just block your talking. He he must have been retaliating or something crazy. You can get removed indefinitely for foul language or bad language. They, that's part of bad conduct. Was this a guy that was leading his division? I don't know if he's leading division or not. I remember a thread about a guy that was leading, and uh, I think it was the championship, and he was pretty aggressive. Does his last name start with a T? Just say the name. Initials are M G, is what I'm being told. Yeah. Okay, it's not the same person though. Someone you're hoping for there, 25? Uh, kind of. 10 for. I wouldn't be the only one, trust me. There was a whole race of people that was hoping for it. That's not a racist. There's a whole race of people. I meant there's a whole bunch of people. A gaggle. Oogly googly. So there was a herd of people wanting somebody to get kicked out. Hi, bud. Do you want to go and get back to the line? Why does everybody pit the one to go and then come by us again? Yeah, they're all faster than me. Can you clean them up real good there? I know, and you I'm know, I'm using a lot 15. of brakes, so if you want to try that lever forward, I don't know if it'll help or not, but just one more tool you have. Still got to get another pit stop. I'm going to use the excuse I'm saving my tires for long green runs. Me too. I'm hearing he was cheating. They are checking for that, guys. How do you cheat? How do you cheat with a pick setup? There's a program. Yes, it's not supposed to be talked about, but there is a program, and even if you mention it, they don't play. I mean, you're not allowed to give the name. I can tell you there was a Brazilian that was caught using it, banned for life. There was 30 people banned. And there was a bunch of them banned for life, what, two months ago? Two and a half, three months ago? Ah, yes, there was a, someone with a, a TNL that was a pro driver that got banned. I believe it's TNL. I believe, I believe it was a whole, a one of the teams, some team. That guy's going green. Good to hear. All right, coming to the green. Green, green, green. No pressure, Alex. Everything's rolling good. Front. Door, bumper. By himself, no run in your mirror. Sorry about that 21. I didn't know you were there. My father didn't say anything until the last second. Come on up, bro. Clear low. 
clear low. Bye. Clear, 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 clear. Wow. Oh, somebody just lost it coming out of three there. Oh my gosh, the pace car came out. I thought the car was coming up and about to hit me. <laughs> this keeps up, and I'm going to have guaranteed top 20, please. Yeah, I got suspended one time when I first got this game, so I didn't know you'd get suspended. Cause Checking up on the long pond street. And yeah, I retaliated and got suspended for a week. I've only been protested for uh, cursing. Um, I just got a warning, thankfully. Uh, I've been a good boy. The most of mine has been for foul language or race oriented remark. Oh, I did get suspended for two weeks for uh, an incident, but I appealed it and won my appeal. I've had guys run directly into me and not get suspended, but I got a warning for letting my car roll down into somebody that had wrecked me. Yeah, I know about that. Uh, it sucks. The guy says during the race, Robert, I got to come by, uh, well, my number, you know, 23, I got, I need to pass. And three quarters of a lap later, he bumps me in a turn. I saved it, he hit the wall. <laughs> Vladimir, did you uh, get some pretty bad damage from that wall hit? I think I'm okay. 10 four. I didn't even know you hit the wall, and then next thing I know, the guy just dives down after you hit it, and I almost hit you. And I, I was very lucky we didn't end up together. I think it was the just light bulb. Trying to figure out so. when my last pit stop's going to be. I'm not exactly sure. Kind of depends on the race, but I know I'm going to make a last Damn, there's still 25 guys out. Yeah, I know Clint and I were talking in practice. I, Clint, you were in that practice with me, right? Yeah, Tempo. Yeah, I remember we were saying we, we didn't even think anyone would be able to finish this race the way they were driving. Now, this really hasn't been as bad as I thought it was going to be. Pretty good group here. Lots of give and take. This fix setup doesn't fit my driving style. I'm having a hard time with it. Yeah, me too. That's my excuse. <laughs> it's my first week on the track. I'll take whatever I can get. Okay, those last 20 laps just flew by. I ran the open last night and finished 10th. Well, that's good. I was going to say, but on the previous subject, I've only ever had a warning of battling over in the IndyCar fixed wars that go on there. I've been here almost four years and I've never had a protest against me. I forget what, it was in this series, and I forget what race it was at, but uh, I got, uh, like I said, I got suspended, they suspended me for two weeks, about 10 miles I out. appealed it, a little bit there. and uh, won, the, won the appeal, because the guys that protested me didn't show the part where my engine had blown, and I told them I was going to go low to get out of get off the track.
I got protested because I said God's name in vain after I got wrecked by someone on purpose. And the guy that was in there was actually on my friend's list. He was like, why did you say God's name in vain? I was like, well, I could have said a lot worse. I just, I probably even shouldn't have said that, but I'm sorry. He still protested me. He was a big Christian person, so he thought he took a big time offense. I have no idea how many times I've heard people say, God damn it. I've even heard Christians say it. Yeah, I wanted to say a lot worse, and I thought about it, and then I just kind of blurted that out when I really shouldn't have. I mean, I agree, but, you know, for him to be my quote-unquote friend and then protest me because he took offense, that, that was kind of sad. No, if you get a protest, because if it's not, you know, fully well, depends how Nim sees it. Good conversation. Oh, no, he told me. He said, I'm protesting for that. There's no there's no place in our race for it. You know, somebody's going to go racial or, you know, death threats, crap like that. That's but anything else. No, really, what, what's the point in protesting someone? They get a, a two-week or a six-month suspension or, or whatever. They come back in under a different name, and they're right back to racing. They might not be in the same series again, but they're right back to racing. One to go at the line. Seems like the fastest way around one and two is definitely right on the line, but it definitely looks like when they're, you could uh, get on the outside of somebody in three and four, that's been pretty successful the whole race so far. Outside road. Just to make sure when you get on the back stretch, we uh, work them in real good, clean their rears up. All right, behind Trevin. Line up behind the pen. Maybe I'll uh, knock them a little bit. If I can catch Alex, them. Alex, get all that faster. gravel up there, you're not going to be able to do that anymore. <laughs> That'll never happen. Behind that tent. And it goes quiet. People are serious. Sorry about that. I spun my tires. Not again, 18. They're trying to get everybody single file again here. Oh, Danny, go right, Sorry, fellas. 
Man. You realize you're costing a fortune in tires? Uh, send me the bill. I'll fix it up. I mean, there's 40 laps left. All right. 37 I'm laps not gonna, left. Don't have to pass in the first lap. Matt, I'm not driving out. Trust me. <laughs> Thanks, Scott. That was a good 30. What happened? I think somebody fell asleep. I'm surprised I didn't cause a wreck. I stacked it to feel like a mother. I went all Jeff Gordon on that restart. Be open here. It is going to be open. Michael, you okay? Yeah, we're it's awesome. I'm glad we're under constant safe. Good up there behind the eleven. Two X for going after a marshal. This kind of reminds me a little bit of the Kansas race where if we're going to have a bunch of cautions, I'm not going to pit. So. See if I can get a hat trick. Just uh, stay out. If you do that, I'm going to come back there. I'm going to take all your tires, all of them. You're not going to be able to take any. <laughs> getting a lot, getting a lot of practice in and out of the pits. Last night during the open series, I spun going, going out of three. I spun right into the pit road, so I didn't have time to serve my my penalty. But that was a mess. On at Eleven. Ended up fifth in that race. Thankfully, this track's big enough that you can recover from stupid shit like that. Well, there's a caution bank coming out, you know, it might it. Line up behind the 11. What is next week's track? Michigan. Michigan next week. Well, I, and then after that, we just can really have some fun. Sonoma. Right, behind that Sonoma. I hate that track. I do too. It's harder than Watkins Glen, but. I just wish they had four course caution. The DWC guys race those tracks. Line up behind the car. No, they ain't even want to race it. I like that track a lot. These cars are fun road right racing here. with. Light still red down there. I like Watkins Glen, Line and I like Montreal, but this track, or right, so no, I mean, I just hate it because it's the uphill blind turns that drive me insane. I'm practicing there a couple of nights this week already, trying to get something, and it is slick. It is real slick. We're going to have 75 degree weather. I had it wrote down here. Behind that 11. I'm wrong. 81 degree weather. Winds out of the south at 18 miles per hour. And a 52% relative humidity. And partly cloudy sky. I guess sky. if we did have full course There's pressures your Sonoma on the road, race weather. it'd be, be a lot like this. Yeah, it's just a little bit disappointing when you get behind somebody that spins out and you got to get on the brakes, and then the guys in front of you get a two-second lead on you.
If I run it, I'm going to get in the back and just stay there. I did gla I did pretty good last year, and then I came down to like five to go and drove it into the wall. Did y'all race Sonoma last year for this series? Yes. Yes, they did. Oh, okay. Because I didn't come in until late, late in the season. Did we? I thought we just raced Washington's Glen last year for the series. Nope. Raced Sonoma, and it was slick as can be. Man, I don't remember doing it. Maybe I was, uh, I, that might have been when I was on vacation. It was the same time, so I figure that's what it is. Wanting to go when you get back to the line there. Looks like a good clean dump I'm there. a guest driver. I only uh, did a couple of races. Get a good restart, bud. I'll let you know what you got there. Yeah, I, I don't I do this series. Outside there, bud. Outside. As a, as a uh, regular. It's my first full year. So last year I was a Boris. But, you know, now we got all the tracks that NASCAR runs on. I'm glad to see them put the uh, road courses in the schedule. I think Montreal. I like Montreal. I mean, that's one of my favorite tracks. And the seasons before all of these, uh, before this year, they would put, like, Milwaukee or uh, William likes the Twin Ring or... Iowa was another one that they they would use in place of those tracks. Milwaukee. That Motegi track was crazy. I tried it in the fixed day. That's a tough little track too. I'll try not to spin my tires this time, guys. <laughs> if I get a hat trick, I'm out of here. You won't be able to find your tires. Hell no, don't ever give up, Todd. Don't you listen to Kozlowski? What was that? Alright, man. Nice boost shift here. I'll so don't ever three. give up, man. Clear, clear, clear. You hate that turn, don't you, William? And it, for this race, I do. In the open series, I can get through that at 168 miles an hour. Hey, you made it, man. That was fucking special. Good job, Tom. I don't know this. With this series, this setup seems awful. I want spinning on the side out of one. He saved it. Valdemar, or Valdemar, if you hit that uh, wall again, I'm going to just marry you guys. I'll just put it in your door for you. So you're kind of blinking every now and then. 18, I'll give you the low side here. Go ahead, four, go, go up.
Forget it, forget it. out for debris. Yeah, so you're starting to warp and blink too. Left that 50. Ooh, that was tight. Scared I could. Scared I couldn't squeeze in there, Devin. Okay, I didn't catch what corner we were in. I didn't want to call the wrong corner. Todd, that was the. That was the wrong turn, Todd. Yep. Yeah. Well, I don't know that. And there he flipped me back quarter panel. You know, my bad dude, I lost it. I, I clipped you. You know, I apologize. One of the rare times I nail number one and I'm on the gas and they're all on the brake coming out. Ah! Checking up outside of one. I kind of saw that one coming, you know. You can see that there. Oh, wild. That uh, 18 car that Todd, you know, he's not great at controlling his car. I, you know, I don't think that one was his fault, but he's been any damage or just spun been out in? coming in uh, turn three. Oh, twice Todd's in a row. got engine problems. He was smoking. Yeah, I'm done. So, blind up. I'm sorry to hear that, Todd. Yeah. Wasn't he one of the past dudes? I think he was fast and also had, was having complications with turn three. Loose is fast and on the edge out of control. Cole. All right, but just uh, Kyle Bush now. Well, there goes Michael. Time for the 10:30 race. Line up behind the pen. What is there another race tonight that's fixed? Do what? Not till Saturday. For the uh, A series open. God, my pit crew slow. Jesus. I'm practicing uh, spinning around the guy in front. One day our racing is going to activate uh, contact in the pits, I guess. So I got caught speeding. Got pulled in right in front of me. I slammed on the brakes and then got back on the gas and just went a little bit too fast. I figure one day our racing is going to activate contact in the pits. That's going to be intense. Especially with how tight some of these pit boxes are. Behind that pit. Are they really like that? Or is there, is there, a, there shouldn't be a scaling problem. They're really like that in places. More of an inner ear problem. Kind of how we do our proximity in the real world. Life. We probably stop a little further back in the pit box than what they do in real life. Which makes it, sometimes it makes it tighter. But like Martinsville, the, the boxes there are real tight. Uh, Bristol, same way. That's still 25 cars. Well, I'm be getting better at that spinning out of the so, box stuff. Just gonna... Before I used to spin and hit the wall. <laughs> no reason to pit so far, I don't think. If you notice in, no in this series or in anything open. I read, we don't have those little red blocks or boxes that they do in uh, real NASCAR. And when they start putting those in there, that's it's, when you're going to start seeing gonna a lot of problems. going to be down to 25 laps left. So. But it might make it a little better Just getting all in and out of the pass box. Me. You talking about the tape on the 
on pit road where they put the red tape down? Yeah, yeah, where they tape off where your tires are supposed to be, where you're supposed to stop. Yeah. Yeah, but I can't see my tires when I'm driving. You mean we have to watch on replays and that's where people will improve? They can't see their tires when they're driving either. Though, with that said, they have a spotter counting down. Three, two, one. They count it. Right. Brian, were you the first out of pits? Plus, half the time, they don't even make it inside them little boxes anyway. I thought those marks were just guidelines where you would want to stop, ideally. That's where you have to stop. At least two tires have to be within, those, within that. No, that's wrong. It just has to be within the white line of the pit box. That's just guide markers. That's yeah, those guide markers are put down by the, the, the team just for ideal stopping so you can get out of your pit if someone's in front of you. And so the tire changer's nowhere to be. Yeah, yeah, because I go to Daytona just about every year, and that's all it is for. The, the white lines is what counts. If you're outside that white line, you're in trouble. Okay. I thought it was outside those boxes. But... I mean, that's what they talk about each week. Big time. I'm, pre I'm pretty sure in here, if you, you know, sit way close to the wall, it penalizes you. Time wise. I haven't been to Daytona since the early 70s. Oh, I'm aging myself. Hey, Clint, you said you're going down there, right? Yeah, yes, I'll. You know, just keep working on saving some gas. Nice. It's not that uh, scaffolding they're away, putting but, up, because uh, I was out there for the shootout, here, we don't waste the scaffolding, it. man, it's high. It looks like a, it's going to look like a football stadium. Oh, nice. Yeah, I've been there three times before this time. I've been to the Coke Zero. Yeah, have a good night there, Todd. See you, Todd. Hey, sorry there, three. I was just clutching. I wasn't trying to hold you up or nothing. Yes, better than Travin. You were the first person out of the pits? Yeah. This is going to be interesting, starting back here. Yeah, that's what I was hoping. Yeah, I might start in third. Yeah, maybe we'll see the next one, Todd. Todd, try being in the Daytona race and missing a gear and causing everyone to wreck. That's when you should feel sorry. It's happened to me. It was pretty embarrassing. I did that at Phoenix. don't remember which track it was, but on the last restart, the leader spun into outer pit wall, and he took out like a third of the field. I finished with engine damage, but I finished. Could have been Charlotte. I don't remember. It could have been. I man, make sure you take about everything warm last time here. Yes, you were. Clean them up real quick here for me before we go to the green here. So third. Going good, going good. Three wide up front here. Oh my god. I don't know if that was 26 or 6, but thank you very much. Come on, guys. Why do you want to do something stupid like that? Sweet, well. I cannot believe I made it through that. Shit, there's no caution. Good man, I got I got six minutes of damage because of somebody in pace. No running here, man. Thanks a lot, six. You're clear. You're clear. I was just cooling around like it was a caution. Yeah, I was too. Now I'm way behind. Clear, 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 
Whoever just sat on the track, thank you. I'm guessing his car was so bad he couldn't make it out of four properly. Nope. I don't know, but I'd like to know what his pro big problem was. Not being patient. Yeah, I mean, what was the deal there? I just saw some smoke. I don't even know. I just, I somehow I got through it. There was cars coming right in front of me, coming down. They clipped me, spun me into the wall, and then spun out. And I, somebody spun into me when I tried going low to miss it all. I seen it starting, so I went low and shouldn't have went there. Check up them two. Or, yeah, one, sorry. Nation from me. Well, something happened at the start that checked everybody up that I think caused that. Yeah, the inside line didn't go. I ended up hitting the guy in front of me. I barely hit him, but I did. And uh, well, started smoking up front. This was the outside line that got beat up. Yeah, so on the, somebody in the, up the front, towards the front, didn't go. Top two guys had a good start. I don't know about the guys behind us. Sixteen minutes three wide and turn long. Imagine that. You got fifteen minutes out of that? That could be the rest of the race. Or he came down after he hit something because he was smoking when he hit me. He barely tapped me. He was able to stay off me, but he hit me a little bit. Uh, he definitely hit something pretty good, though. I saw the smoke. I don't get what the big hurry is in the first freaking corner. With 20 something laps left, or, or what? I mean, oh, laps left. Why are you wanting to go three wide in such a big hurry? But you ain't, it's not, the race ain't over. Open this time. You're not going to win it. On cold cars. Yeah, one in front of you is uh, back before the third finish line. No, so it's because of big ass wreck and then everybody else's race. That's what they like to do. All right, behind that pace car. Do you get involved that one, Clint? But I'm still waiting to hear an explanation from the six. Oh, he's blaming it on the 16 went three wide. That's what I saw. Like I said, I don't know if it was the six or the 26 or the 16. One of them, it was a car with a six on it. Well, you're the 26. <laughs> I know I didn't do it. The 16. <laughs> Tempo, I know. Damage. Alex Martinelli. Yeah, if you watch the replay, I don't know how I made it through that. I mean, cars had come right in front of me, and I was lucked out. I can't stop and watch the replay, because if I do... It'll stop fixing my damage, then I gotta go out and come around again. No, just uh, go on your fuel panel, say begin, click the begin yeah, fuel button, and uh, pick it right back off, and it'll keep doing your repairs. I'll look at it at the end of the race. My car is ruined now anyway. Heard that I got 13 minutes of optional and two minutes required. Yeah, there's definitely some good cars taken out of that one. Yeah, I'm out. Thanks a lot, Alex. Smug move. Vladimir, I'm sorry I was blaming you, but I, I, like I said, I don't know who did it. Yeah, I don't think it was Vladimir. Vladimir was right to the right of me. I didn't see him do anything. It looked like he was just involved with it when they all started in front of us. Yeah, it wasn't the 6, because the 6 was right in front of me. It had to have been the 16. He was dive-bombing earlier pretty hard, too. Yeah, it was the 16. Yeah, I, I'm sorry, Vladimir, for blaming you. I, like I said, I don't know who it was. I don't know if there was a 6. 
I was waiting the whole way for the stupid move of number 16 because of I know him for that because he ruined one of my races I don't before. Have a car. No problem. See you again. Alright, you have a good night. Well, I guess he ain't gonna give us an explanation for his stupid move neither. I was kind of hoping that the, uh, you know, the dive bombers had been weeded out by now. No. <laughs> Never. Shit, there's only 20 laps left. Yeah, I've been the lucky dog twice. That's funny, my spotter didn't tell me to get my ass off the road. Spotter's drunk. Maybe because you were up front when you got it. You were in the pit. Yeah, I pit every time. <laughs> uh, down to uh, 20 on the lead lap. So. I was against the wall. I was in the wall. And that is why I didn't pit that time. I didn't pit that time neither and restarted this race in six. I just got ran over like I was a... Do you want to go up the line, man? Keep working it in real good. Keep well, all the restarts have been crazy so far. All right, man, it's the side row. Just the way this track is. Well, there's decision making that's been, you know, partly responsible. Just a loose nut behind the wheel. I mean, the races only start with about, you know, the last quarter, the last third. Until then, you're just driving. Can y'all let me know when the pace car is out of two? Yeah. Thank you. I did it every single time at Dover, and I won the race. So, eh, you just got to be take your time. It depends on the race, though. I took it easy. I saved my car, kept it off the walls, had zero contact, and so I had the best arrow at the end. Best tires, too. The higher the split, the more you got to race. Do man. Take stars XV too. Thank you. Hopefully I can get called up before y'all go green. But I got all my damage fixed. Yeah. Entering turn three. No, I ain't gonna get it. I'm just going into turn one. Alright man, nice boost shift here. I'll call the green. Make sure you get any kind of easy so we get a good runoff. Yeah, 16 flat out, just ran the 26 up in the wall. Green, 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 rolling good, buddy, man. Everything's rolling through. Man, the inside line just doesn't go. I don't know what the deal is. Down there. McLean, uh, I will gang you. You're all clear. You're
got a big hole in the left side of my car now. Man, the 15 right side is crushed. I don't know how he's still hitting 200 mile an hour. Been out of one. Been out of one. Sorry, Tim. Fuck it. Side inside. You are all clear there. Sorry, Michael, the slope. Wolfgang, you're uh, blinking just a little bit, but it, it's it's all right, man. It ain't bothering me. Michael, you're across it. There goes Trent. Yeah, spinner. Single file here, bud. So close here, Stevie. So close. Slow down, right, front straight. 21. Where did I go? Car turn coming out to or one, whatever. That was all me. Just thinking about the next corner before I got to the current one. Yeah, don't you hate that when you overthink yourself? I'm now in second place. I'm kind of hoping that's Stephen Pitts, but I doubt it. Well, I thought I was good. I, I was already in the gas, and so, then as soon as I started getting out of the corner, it just started coming around on me. Not my favorite place to start, but I guess it's better than 20th. Man, there's so many people to more that a uh, lot on the tunnel turn. They need to get paid. Still got uh, yeah, I hate when 20 they cars on the track. Found out the reason they don't put uh, lights up here in Pocono, not only because of the money, um, it's more because of the fog at night. It will at least that's what I was told. All right, man. We should be uh, clear out. Oh, yeah. coming outside here eventually. He wrecked everybody, then he gets the lucky dog. A lot of justice in that. NASCAR would have took set park tape for over aggressive driving. Technically, you should be able to protect them because they say you're supposed what uh, avoidable accidents and all that stuff. Yeah. But they'll call it a racing incident. Did he, I mean, what happened? Did he do it on purpose or did he just go in too hard? Oh, no, we, we was coming up to speed. I don't know what he did. 
Hey, Danny, we got issues, buddy? Was this deep park in the pins oil? Uh, let's try not to have a steep park incident here, please. What's that? Pit road will still be closed. Here. Let's try not to do a steep park in Dell Jr. wreck here, like they did. Don't know. Still surprised we haven't had a really big one yet. Shh. Yeah. Waiting for the five to go. Pacing. I just kind of knew it was going to be this way. Are we going to be down to uh, oh, crap. 13 laps? Right behind us. So, what I'm hoping for is I'm hoping hey, for a top, top 15 finish, but a top 10 will obviously be yeah. real nice, and top uh, 5 would be even nicer than that. Um, but uh, I'm not hoping upon hope on anything except for top 15. And, uh, Did so anybody notice uh, he use, was uh, up to pace? Uh, lose, what I saw, he was pretty fast. Lose 13 spots and uh, 13 laps, so let's hope not. I don't know. I might. I mean, it might have been me. I might have started off too slow, but I was trying to keep from spinning my tires too. Well, our jobs. When we're behind someone, just try to stay off of them. I mean, if you start off slow, we're supposed to be able to react to that. I'm not saying it's going to happen every time. Obviously, it doesn't. But we got to be responsible for that too. Yep. All right, man. Nope. Uh, I want to go right here. I mean, I've been behind people that's like that too, but. I've seen, you know, really bad circumstances of, you know, all the stars lining up and it snowballed and the guys in the back just got creamed. It was nothing intentional, it was just bad timing. Looks like a pretty nice to run, but when there ain't no, nowhere to go, there's such a thing is called applying the brake. It's like a pretty nice car that Josh has there in the 25. I kind of see it uh, behind me. Next Watch to the your butt, Timothy. He's starting on the inside too, isn't he? I wonder if he's going to try to go under all of us. He could be working with someone up here in the front. You never know. I mean, he could cause a wreck with five laps to go just to make sure his friend wins. I've seen it happen with other people. That should be protesting. How do you prove it? I don't know. He's right behind Ricky. Man, make sure you check about everything one last time here. Make sure you clean them up real quick here for me before we go to the green here. All right, don't pass the five.
green, green, green. Mm -hmm. Oh, we get front. Don't check up. It's coming in. It will open next time. Quickie yellow seat. Door. Bumper. Oh, Scott, you warped out. Clear, clear, clear. All clear, yeah, all clear. Yeah, I saw that. Not by one. Sorry about that, 20. You all right, Wolfgang? Doesn't matter if I'm all right. Race right. is over since the last crash. I'm sorry for hitting you in the back, but you are so slow in the corner. Who, me? You guys, I don't want watch out. One of them is 16. I thought he was up at the front by now. I thought he was leading the race. way coming up through there on that restart. Yeah, I thought I was a car out of hell.
by himself there, door. Clear, clear, clear. Appreciate it. Spinner out of two. He's on the wall inside. Toss it down, toss it down. Shoot! Damn, we're gonna get a... We admit, no, I don't think we'll get a one lap. I don't know yet. Still closed right here. I don't think we will. Up I hope not. I want to finish 14. Okay, five about 12. I didn't want to see that crap. Sorry, guys. Got loose coming out of one. Turn one kills me. Just when I think I can get on the gas, you hit a bump and it'll spin you around. And there'll be a one lap shootout. Great. There will be a one straightaway shootout. Got one corner. Good win, 16. Middle of the straight. After he took everybody out, he can't help but win. No, Scott. Survival will be key. <laughs> Especially where you are. Man, it's going to be open here. Just listen to TV. Uh, he'll let you know to do. I saw someone uh, mess around here and do the fake pit about a year ago. Guy was doing the fake pit. He was the leader. Ran right into the pit pressure. wall. It was freaking hilarious. <laughs> yeah, sometimes you're looking in your mirror trying to fake people out and forget to look in front. Eleven coming outside here eventually. See, eleven. That's the first lucky dog I hear. Yeah, that's true. That was always in pit. Left that 11 in front of you. All right, I'm just going to try to get the best finish I possibly can. Um, I am worried about the craziness that happens, especially with the one or two lap shoot out here. And I got a little bit old tires, so. I can't, uh, I can't drive in too deep, so I'm going to have to break a little bit earlier. So we're just going to have to uh, see what happens. Well, the race is going to finish on the yellow. That's the best you can get. After going green for about, what, 
top of Front Street. I know I'm going to go ahead and take it for a while. I mean, you got to. Ah, oh, crap. I just realized I'm two cars in front of you know who, and I'm on the outside, he's on the inside. I am so dead. Oh, I'm starting at first gear. Just let everyone know. I'm starting in six. I'm starting in reverse. Neutral. I'll probably just start in neutral. From where you are, that's probably the best bet. Yeah, thanks to the 16, I'm like this right now. You gonna race again Saturday? Oh, yeah. Alan, pull out to the right a little bit so I can see your car. Well, Scott, you keep on slowing him down. Okay, cool. Now I got a target. No, I you know, Brandon and I have been going at it this whole race. He's been in front of me or behind me this whole damn race. Yep. Ah, oh, hell. One lap. It's gonna get ugly. I'm just gonna try to keep my car clean, seriously. But the one to go at the line. Make sure you check up everything one last time. All right, we'll be. I just know I'm at the mercy of everyone else around me, so I'm pretty screwed. Damn, it's still possible to finish outside the top 20. All right, I'm pretty worried about it because Josh says that he's going to start in first gear and he's willing to take a three wide and all that other stuff, so. Um, and we're we're basically thinking what regular NASCAR drivers think during a green-white checker. You know, they're thinking like, oh, God, it's going to get ugly, especially at Daytona or Talladega. And you know there's guys that hate to race around, too. Yep. There's got to be one guy this season that uh, causes more wrecks than the others. Ricky Stein, uh, Steinhouse, listen to me. Ricky Steinhouse, I would say, has been causing a lot of damn wrecks. When I came into this race, I had a four point something safety rating. But I also had 302 incidents in the uh, open series. That means anything. I'm going to give you a hint. Here's the hint. Focus on your I rating. If you focus on getting good I rating, just having a you know a consistent finishing spot, you'll race with better people for the most part. Not all of them are that good, but I'm just saying the higher it goes, the better off the races will be. Oh no! What I was getting though at that point was. All right, man. I'll call the if you're not hitting something or somebody ain't hitting you, you ain't doing it right. At least that's what I was told. Green, green, green. Everything's rolling good. Everything's rolling real good in front of you there. Door, middle of the track. Wow, five foot of tires. You're clear. Good job. Aw, oh, see? Cost what was that, Spree?
Come on. Left Come on. Somebody went right in the middle and took me out in one, and I got engine damage. I'm trying to move up. You have to run me over? Somebody spun their tires there on the start. And Behind that 15. Uh, you, when you spun your tires, I checked up a little bit, got a little swirly, and then the guy behind me went diving. Yeah, I dove down, but I had to let out because we were, I would have passed you before the start finish line. I just hope I don't grenade before. White flag right here, hit your mark. Yeah, I thought Austin was going to get me there. He spun his tires as well, come up in front of me. Damn, lost two spots, that hurts. That's racing, though. Then you story what happened yesterday. Not too happy about the guy's brake checking in the one, though. How am I brake checking you? I had a guy in front of me slam on the brake. Then it wouldn't be you, would it? You got a point. Well, I was the one he ran over, so. I'm going to be clear and clear. I'm going to finish speaking. seventh. So. Yeah, good win. <laughs> Not too bad. Yeah, Brian, I was really worried about it. Good win, 16. Good win. I hope I don't get a fourth pit. I still got only a white flag. If you don't get a force pitch, you'd already gotten it. No, oh, it would have told you right out the line, man. They would have given you a black flag right there. You're all right. Ooh, six place. Six place, I got it. Like, uh -oh. Now that's got to suck. Right at the end of the race. Nice work, bud. Nice work on that last one. I've got a few more. That's a good job, man. Well, hopefully soon enough we'll be up in the next area. You're pretty close to it. Yeah, same here, Travin. Who won? Steven? Steven, good job. These guys stopped on the track that's getting the crap out of me. I'm looking at F3 twice. I actually don't think I had one. I don't even know if I got a 2X for that one hit with uh, that one guy. I think I may have came out maybe with a 2X. That's it. That's all race. Hey, uh, Josh, what lap was that on that 16 took everybody out? Like 20 to go, I believe. Yeah, okay, thank you. Alright, so uh, sixth place, uh, happy with that? Means I'm not going to race Saturday, guys. So, I don't know, a lot of pacing. Going to be uh, listening to a lot of race chat, which uh, I enjoy on other people's channels, but. Yeah, lap 55. Not it. So, thank you.